Okay guys, this is my RC crawler, and today, I'm going to turn it into a Lego car. The suspension on this car is really good, so we're going to make it a truck. This RC car is really fun to play with, but we're going to have to see how it does when it's Lego. Okay. So the cover actually just unclips and then it comes off. But I'm going to show you how I'm actually going to mount Legos on this thing. But the suspension is insane on this thing. So I'm going to try to wrap it around the frame. Oh god. Okay, I'm going to try to wrap it around the frame like this. And then I'm going to do the same thing with the middle. But before I start working with Legos, I'm going to wash the car off because it's completely waterproof. I think. Okay, the car is outside drying. While it's drying, I'm gonna show you the mounts that I made for the RC car. So this one is gonna go on the back, and then this one is gonna go on the middle. I made it longer so that we can make out the sides. Guys, I really hope this works. All right, now that it's done drying off, we can try to put these things on. I did the back one first, and then I'm going to the middle, and then we're going to connect them together. I'm going to connect them together with a really, really long plate. Okay, now we can put on the plate. Done some more work on the car, and I think I know the design I want to do. Okay, now I'm going to do the other side of the car. Okay guys, so this is actually a brake light. We're going to see if we can attach it on the back right here. Okay, I actually had to change these two studs out, so we'll see if it works now. Okay, let's see if it works now. Okay, I think we're good guys. Okay, now we're gonna take it out for a little test drive. Guys, it's been raining like this all week, but we're gonna try to do the test drive anyways. Okay, it's working well, but I noticed a lot of pieces were falling off as I drove it. I'm definitely going to need to work on the frame a bit more. It just broke right off. Okay guys, it is done. I added an extra mount in the front and I finished the back. So now, I think it's finally time to go test it out. So I left my room and took it outside. It was still really wet outside, but I'm going to try to test it out anyways. And I tried using a GoPro, but I don't know if it really works yet. Okay guys, this is future me here, and the GoPro does work. And don't worry guys, I found out that this car is 100% waterproof.
Okay, it was going pretty good, but then I started to notice that a lot of pieces were coming off, but it was still driving, so I think we're good. Okay, at this point, the entire body of the truck was just laying on the frame and there's nothing connecting to the frame. I'm honestly surprised that the body of the car was still on there when there's nothing attached to the frame. And then I couldn't tell if I was stuck to a tire or not. Okay guys, it was going pretty good until this. 